Hello everyone. So today we have two full sets to unbox here. We have a full set of a Sumiko Gorashi Remens, um, and I think this is the Kitchen series. There's a lot of Kitchen series, but this is one of them. And then we also have the new Marmo Sweets collection set. I got both of these from Charms LOL's website. These actually were a lot smaller than I thought. I thought the box was going to be a little bit bigger. And here's the lineup. I just thought the lineup was super cute. Because normally I don't get full sets, but these two I just had to. And then we also have two acrylic Sanrio stickers. Um, and I thought the designs of these were super cute as well. So let's just start opening. I think today we're going to start with the Sumiko Gorashi Remens. So here is the box, and it shows you all the ones you can get right here. What I loved about this remand set is that for every box, you actually get a figure. Because normally, um, there are sets where you don't in every box. Like, you'll just get, like, some accessories for it. Um, but I think it's really nice that you get a figure with every box. And the box for this is so cute. I'll just set it up so you can see how it looks all put together before we start opening. So here's what the box looks like all set up. In this set, there is a total of eight to collect. So let's just get started. I'll do a little close up of the first box. So here's the first box we're gonna open today. And here's the full collection. It's the same as the front, but we can take a closer look. Honestly, my favorite um, that I'd love to see today is these little tapioca beads or the little ebby fries over here. I think they're so cute and I love the shape of the box. Usually they're more like this size and like upright like this, but I love that it's horizontal. So let's just see here. The first one. Oh, we got my favorite one to start off with. Okay. And these also come with a little book. And these usually come with stickers or something like that, or paper crafts. It does. So this one's paper craft is like a little menu, I think. And like a little coupon. So here are all the pieces. And I'll use this as a little um, display so you can see. So it came with this small container. And then I think this holds this, just like that. And then I think this little guy right here, he's like a little puff, sits in there, just like that. And then we have a bowl, and this is supposed to be a little bowl of ramen, I think. It comes with a little tray as well to put it on. Then it also came with a drink. And I'm pretty sure that it's just a glass of water. It came with a little spoon as well. And then here are our two figures. So there's the first one and the second one. And this set is so cute. I love that this one has a little spoon and then this one has a little fork. I think the whole set is very cute. So many tiny pieces though, so gotta be careful not to lose them. There's the first box. Now on to the second one. Heard that they do come in the order that they're placed in the box. So the next one, oh, this one's really big. So this is a table. Which one is this? I think, I think it's this one right here. And then here's the little pamphlet for this one. And then this one just comes with some more little paper crafts as well. So here are all the pieces for this one. This one has a lot of pieces. So for this one, I think I'll just show you it on the table. Comes with this little tray. And then three mini sushis. So we have little, little Ebby Fry. We have just this regular red sushi. And then this character, which I'm not really sure what this one is. Because I don't think I've seen that. Oh, maybe that's Shirakuma. I think that might be Shirakuma. And it also came with this little plate. Here's our figure. It's little Neko. And he comes with super tiny chopsticks. So there he is with his chopsticks. So cute. And then he just stands behind the table like this. Or he could sit on top. 
Next one. So far, I really like all of the sets. Oh, this is Penguin. And then here's the little crafts for him. So let's just take all the pieces out. And I'll display this one on here. So it came with a little tray and then this little box. And then I'm pretty sure this box holds the noodles and this little green slice here. And then it came with tongs. And these are cute because they have a little um, tapioca shape to them. It also came with this little blue snail plate, which I thought was cute. Oh, maybe the, um, the green stuff goes on here. Yeah, I think it goes like that. And then it came with this really cute cup. Just set the drink in the cup. Like so. Then it also came with this tin. And then you put the green stuff in there. And then it also came with this mat as well. So there are all the tiny pieces. And then here's little penguin and he also holds a little pair of chopsticks. And then he just sits right here. Um, let's take a little break from the remints and open one of these acrylic stickers. Um, so here are all the ones you can get and I'm really hoping for... I really want Kodomi and My Melody, but I will settle for any of the ones on the top row. I think the top row are the cutest. Okay, let's see. We got... Oh, it's in a blind bag. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, so we got my Melody. No, we got Hello Kitty. And I thought these were acrylic. Maybe it was my mistake. I think these are just regular stickers. So we got Hello Kitty. And this is so cute. It's like a little holographic one. Let's hope for Chromi and my Melody. Hopefully I don't cut the sticker. Oh! I think you've seen it as it fell. We got my melody. So we didn't get Kiromi and my melody, but we did get my melody. And I think and I think these two stickers look really, really cute together. Back to the remints. We got Oh! Oh, what? I've never seen this character before. Is this like um a new character? Huh. Interesting. And then here is the crafts for this one, right here. Let me look at the box, huh? Yeah, this is a character I've never seen before. That's interesting. So this one also comes with a tray and then this little bowl. And then I think this is some, tor <laughs> some sort of soup or noodles. You just pop that in. It comes with this little chip, and the, even the chip has a face on it, which is so cute. I think it can stand in there, just like that. It fits perfect, but it, it's, it doesn't like stick in place, so it just slides around. It also comes with a green cup with some type of orange juice in it. It's, it's full all the way to the top. But yeah, there are the tiny pieces. And then this one also came with a smaller figure. It's like a little snail. And it's carrying some type of like canister. As like its shell. That's pretty cute. And then our new friend holds a spoon, but I can't get it in his hand. So I'm just going to leave it on the side. But he does hold it. And this is so cute. Um, I don't know when the character came out, but I love his facial expression. It's adorable. And I think we are now at the halfway point. Taking a lot longer than I thought it would. Because I thought it would just be super quick and easy. Oh, we have Tenkatsu. That's why I put um, the other one, but I don't think the sweets collection could be its own video. So I decided to put them two together. Here's a little crafts for this one. So it just basically has this big ice container. And then this little block that goes in there. And then this little 
ball, I guess. I think that sits in there like that. No, the little cup that it comes with sits in there. And then I'm pretty sure the ball goes inside the cup. Just like that. And then I'm not sure where the noodles go, but I'm going to just stick them right there. And then it also comes with a little paddle, but I think Tonkatsu holds the paddle. He is with his little paddle. It is so adorable. He's making noodles. I love his little outfit too. It's such a cute little chef's outfit as well. So third to last. What are we missing? Um, we're missing this one. This one. And... I think we're missing this one as well. So. Oh, we have the one where he's making pastries. And then... So this one comes with a little tray. And then he rolled a little piece of dough that kind of looks like him, that's cute. It comes with a couple of folded noodles or like um, dough pastries as well. This one, we'll slide that one over. Let's stick that one right there. It comes with a rolling pin. I don't think these all go in the tray because it also has this wooden tray for rolling it, but I think it's just easier if I put everything in one spot. So those were the tiny pieces and then Little Shirakoma holds a little knife. Okay, for some reason the knife doesn't want to go in, but the knife also has a little face on it, which is really cute. And then he has a little little baker's hat, which is also adorable. Now for the second to last one for this set. Oh, who's this? Oh, now this is the dinosaur. And then... Here's the little pamphlet for this one. And then all the pieces for this one. This one has really tiny pieces. I don't know if you can see like compared to my like thumb, so tiny. So here's the tray. It comes with a little steam bun basket. That's so cute. It has this little green stuff. Some yellow stuff. I'm so sorry, I'm not sure what it's called. Oh wait, I think we're supposed to put the noodles in first. Let me do that real quick. Okay, so the noodles go in there, and then I think these little guys go on this little plate right here. So let me just do that real quick. So here's the food it comes with. These are so cute. And then it also came with a drink. And this one comes in a brown cup. So there it is. So cute. I love this one. I love the container. And then here he is, and he also comes with chopsticks, but at this point, it's just kind of hard to get in. So maybe we'll try. I'll see. Okay, I was actually able to get it in. I got the little guy with chopsticks. He's so cute. Okay, I love this set. I think this one is maybe my third favorite because the last one is actually my favorite. So let's just open it up. Does anyone remember which one we had left? Ooh. It's the one with the little Ebby fries. So cute. And then here are the paper crafts for this one. And this one also comes with one of those little stands. Oh, this one has a lot of tiny pieces. Wow. So here is the little table. And I think I'm going to put the little guys right here. Okay, so this goes... Actually, no, this goes right here. And then this comes with little cookies. Up close, I actually don't think they're cookies. They're some type of fried food, but we'll set that right here for now. Then it also came with a little pair of tongs again. Set that there. It came with this little bottle, I think, of soy sauce. Put that right there. And then it also came with this little, like, Fuji plate, which is so cute. And then we have our two little Ebby fries. They are so cute. I like the triangle one. Its face is adorable. And I'm just going to stick these little guys down here. Just because it's a lot easier. So there is the full set. Let me know which one was your favorite. I'm honestly torn. 
because I really love the little tapiocas, um, but I surprisingly really love the Neko set as well. Um, but yeah, that was it for this set. Now let's move on to the, the Marmo Sweets set. We're going to move on to this set, and this is the Marmo Sweets collection, and I think there are six designs to get. Yes, there are six. There are two of the Marmo sandwiches, the Marmo Dorakis, and then the shaved ice ones. Um, so let me just put the box together to show you the display real quick. There we go, now the display is all set up. It is so cute. And we'll take a closer look at one of the boxes. They're actually very tiny, if you can compare it to the size of my hand, super small. But here's the box, the design is adorable. And then here are the ones we can get. I'm most looking forward to, I think, the sandwich cookies. I'm not a huge fan of these two, but I really wanted these four. So let's open the first one. Oh, it's the pink sandwich cookie. This is so cute. And these are actually pretty squishy as well. They're actually a pretty decent size too. And they all come with a little ball chain. Oh, this one is like a little seal because it has like the little, <laughs> the little balls on its face. Um, or like a little snout. That's cute. I love how simple the design is. Because it makes like the small details like the blush look really nice. It's little feet. And it doesn't really smell like anything, just like the common, like, chemical, like, squishy scent. On to the second one. Oh, this is the Doriaki. So this is the plain Marmo Doriaki. Oh, this one's really squishy. Oh, this one's so soft. I do wish it had a little bit of a design at the top, but it is very small, so I understand they probably couldn't print it. But it is so cute. This one's definitely a lot softer than the sandwich cookie. On to the third one. There we go. Oh, and this is the regular sandwich cookie. This one's actually a lot denser than the other sandwich cookie. That's funny. I do like that they're all different um, textures, I guess, instead of them all being the same slow risingness and like density and stuff like that. Here it is. I think I like the color of that one a lot nicer than this one. But, I do think this one is so cute. The chemical scent on this one is really strong, though. Okay, on to this one. Oh, blue. This is the shaved ice. Oh, the colors of this one are actually a lot darker than they are on the box. Oh, this one is so soft. I think this is the most slow rising one for sure. Oh yeah, this one's insanely soft. Here it is. It is so sparkly too. So I guess the shaved ice ones have like tiny glitters in them. So 
so nice. I love little marshmallow design. Oh, this is the pink one. Oh, this is a lot cuter than I thought it would be. This is adorable. This one's like the same texture as like the pink Doriaki. So cute. I love the colors. I wasn't sure about the colors or like the shape of this one, but I definitely like the pink one. Last one, um, I think this is the other Doriaki, so it's the matcha one. It is, it's so cute. And this one, this one feels like, um, doughy. It feels more doughy. I do wish the matcha color was probably a little bit darker so it matched better with the bun, but I do think it's very cute still. everyone so that was the end of today's video let me know which thing was your favorite i love this set i think it is so cute and i think my favorite actually has to be the pink drink even though i thought i wasn't gonna like it i ended up really loving this one so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video and thank you guys so much for watching i hope you have an amazing rest of your day